welcome this is the energy vibration um lazing for the sun moon and rising aries i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back um it is wonderful because this week um we're celebrating independence on the 4th of july and this is um wonderful i want to say to each and every one who is celebrating have a wonderful time be um be very good to each other okay um please remember to listen to your sun moon and rising and for you aries you need to um i want to say thank you thank you to each and every person um thank you for connecting with me thank you for the wonderful messages that you have all left behind because it's healing someone else will be reading it and understanding that they also are going through the same situation and someone can talk about it so Whenever you leave a message, you know that somebody else will read it and, some, and it will help someone else. Okay, this is how we are going to start the chain connection and and the networking of helping and bringing positive energy and healing other people through this. Okay, this is the energy vibration of the wheel of fortune. The energy of the wheel of fortune is the energy of the week, but this is so wonderful because this is going to affect your life, and I can all see it in your cards because you are having the energy vibration of so many things your own energy vibration is here yet still it is in the reverse form but it is here helping you with um, situation causes cosmetic situation with other people situation that has come from lifetime and lifetime before okay so what is here for your focus it is the energy of the star the energy of the star so this is good and this is for the feminine aspect of you people whatever is happening is for the feminine aspect there's something that is coming up that is saying it's for the feminine aspect so all the women out there um nice good um situations are going to come in manifesting if you were always manifesting something for the women you're going to see it appear in this week as we look at your reading love is here money is here but yet still new beginnings are here as we look at Monday we have the seven of swords in reverse the energy of the seven of swords is that um, you were trying to get away with something and it didn't happen that is for some people out there what is happening though is that we have the energy of the number six comes up number six is um an energy that you need to understand that you have one and six in this week one and six in this week is seven so there's an end to something you're moving away from something so one and six is your number in this week seven comes up again with the seven of swords whatsoever you were doing it's not going to happen because uh, um, there is going to be a stop in your part okay whatever uh, situation that was happening and this is a cosmic situation so this is something that you're working out with someone um, in a cosmetic way okay we have an earth energy on Tuesday and this is temperance you need to have temperance by having temperance you're able to clear whatsoever is happening okay so don't blow up just um, have temperance and um, be aware that um, you need to focus and and use wisdom um, to win your battles whatever is here you have the energy of uh, the men in the reverse form and the men in the reverse form some of you have been vibrating at a at lower energies the last couple of months and that some some people have been doing this uh, for um, seven to eight years and this is um, you have been doing things and getting away with it and no it's not happening so for the men it's going to affect you in this week especially for the men between the ages of five and that of tut and and you know older to 90 whatever you were doing you're not getting away with it and you are in reverse so um whenever these sort of it's uh, um, situation happens you need to understand that there are a certain aspect that is playing out that is um, of uh, uh, not a good energy vibration okay um, I have to put my glasses on okay we're going forward and we're looking we have the energy of the four of Pentacles there is a balance in a situation whatsoever is happening you're having the energy of the four of Pentacles the four of Pentacles have to do with something with an organization. You could have been in business some with some people, and there is going to be a situation that you 
are asked to leave that business or move away from that business whatever it is um, they are going to ask you to leave or move away from that business and these are for the men so whatever you men had done it's going to have an in uh, an um, effect on you and they're going to as if they're they want to pay you out so you move out because they don't want to deal with you any anymore um, on Friday you there's a lot of message that is coming to you a lot of message that is coming to you on Friday whatever um, is happening there's a lot of message coming for the women it's positive message coming um, in at you on Friday positive message for the men there's a, a bit of negative message not for all the men the men who have been vibrating on a negative a lower energy vibration which you have affect a lot of people lives and um, this situation is coming back to um, affect you because it's the wheel of karma so whatsoever you had gave out to someone that was negative you men and women out there it's coming back to you okay we have the energy of what do we have here we have the energy of the five of wands conflicts and strive and this is good and this conflicts and strive is over money this conflicts and strive is over money so as I've said before someone or some of you within an organization within an organization a business um, you have a business and it's affecting the men because it's all it's affecting the men if you had a business or you're in an organization they wants to get rid of you they are trying to pay you off and it's all about money it's conflict about money um they need to get rid of you because of something that you have done so whoever you are out there they need to get rid of you because and this is for the men the men that has the, done something injustice and have this whatever that you have done you have caused shame on an organization or you have brought disgrace to an organization and they want to pay you off or you need to pay back some people will need to pay back some people uh, they want to pay you off and get rid of you okay so on Friday a lot of message will be coming in a lot of emails a lot of connection with emails emails message telephone call that is sort of a thing but whatsoever here is happening you're going to realize that they need to get rid of you and the conflicts is about money and the conflicts is about money and on Sunday is a full moon and on Sunday you have the energy vibration of um, the six of cups so this is um, pleasure with um, someone uh, connection of the past but this pleasure is not really going to last okay it, it seems as if but it's as if they're trying to bring you in this energy vibration but it's not going to last this pleasure okay because they want to find out something they want to get rid of you and they want to find out something and this is for the men for the women it's going to be really a celebration it's going to be a connection with um, a soulmate a cosmic family um, universal beings but yet still with your family with people who you have known uh, soul groups and that sort of a connection and it's going to be a new beginning for some of you women okay so whatever is happening here um, um, for the women it's going to be extremely positive for the men and the women who have done um, stuff to other people and that sort of a thing you are going to see that the energies are coming back to you and it's going to come back to you and hit you okay um, as I said number one and number six is going to be um, your call for this month as we look forward we have temperance in the first half of the week you need to have temperance whatever is happening temperance is the name of the game temperance and then you were trying to get you were trying to do something and get away with it and there is conflicts because it turned out bad for you because it's something that you have been doing for sometimes and you got caught okay so whatever you men were doing and you got caught um, it's, it's going to affect you because it's all about you men because you men end up in the reading and you are in the reverse form you're a king of uh, a king of um, once and you're in the reverse form for some people it can 
um, who have been vibrating on the higher vibration I have been doing good it can um, the effect of the Leo of the Sagittarius that comes in so this is affected a lot of people and uh, um, you are being so profound over this energy of this Leo or Sagittarius so it can um, affect each other in different ways um, as we look at the energy of um, the six of cups and the four of Pentacles six of cups and the four of Pentacles we have um, here the energy of the four of Pentacles so whatever is happening to your financial situation the four of Pentacles is here and there's a celebration but information will be coming into you information is going to come to you and it's um, a whole lot of information it's via the mail it's via the mail I'm getting this information that is coming in via the mail a lot of information a lot of connection via the mail but it's uh, um, do not think that this is the end because this is not the end because there's more to come because you really is a is a cause comic situation that you have caused on yourself and it's going to affect you in the long run okay I'm working with the vortex which is a wonderful deck that I think it's a wonderful deck relationships I don't know what I want clarify those I want <laughs> there is actually something going on about relationships okay it says relationship I don't know what I want clarify those I want whatever you know whatever you do not want you always know and more clearly what you want so, so in any Oregon um, moment of awareness of another person understanding situation giving your individuality attention to the idea of improvement that has hatch from your interaction and observation and as you learn to do that not only will you be of increased value to others but you will see how your relationship with others had immensely to your own becoming so this is wonderful I'm really really loving this because what it is saying is that um, by how you um, radiate yourself and how your interaction observation with other people is coming over to some coming over on someone else this is what is going to help you to move you forward in your life and by that it's going to help you to understand what kind of relationships you want in your life the next message I have is from the energy of the law of abundance and you have the color yellow and this is wonderful and it says plan the celebration now sweep the floor clean the slate pick a date win the shop buy a few new good things on the limb rearrange the furniture pick some flowers take some time off no 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 not necessary because the tipping point has been reached but because this is how you reach it so this is wonderful this is a wonderful energy um, I always let people meditate on this use this card to meditate because yellow is positive yellow is bringing back your own energy because sometimes our energies can um, de deplete door other people but other people can uh, just irritate us and take our energy vibration away so you know um, meditate on those energies and I want to say to each and every person life is wonderful no matter what is happening in your life and see um, everything good or bad in your life as a positive um, lesson see what the lesson is and I know sometimes it's so hard to see the lesson in a situation but there's always a lesson and I'm saying namaste until next week please like and share these videos and um, um enjoy the independence day for the americans and we'll talk later